hello you guys and welcome back to my channel today we are just stepping right into it and by that we're going in with the Jaclyn palette um yes I, I always seem to forget to record an intro I don't know what about me recording I just <laughs> always forget to record an intro but yes we jumped right into it and I went with that really pretty color and then we took this um, this kind of shimmery champagne look it came out really good. I it it came out with a very good with a transitioning color. I thought it just it came out wonderful. And then we went in with this green color and I was putting that on the outer corner of my eye as well as my inner corner. Next I took this shimmery green and I'm just kind of putting that into like a halo effect that's going on right now and I'm putting that in the center base of my eyelid. Um, I found that these colors blended like very well together like almost too much because they almost look the same color just one was very shimmery and then the other one wasn't. So I added a little bit of gold to really make the center base of my eyelid really pop out. The story's over now I must conclude Then here I am just blending all of that together with the upper transi transitioning color and I'm just putting the darker green on my eyelash line. Next I went with the a uh, LA Splash Sinfully Angelic Eyeliner. Um, this eyeliner is good, but I, I still have the problem with this leaking and I don't know why. But I quite enjoy it. Next I'm going in with the Voluminous Lash Paradise Mascara. I think this one's by L'Oreal, if I remember right. This eyelash or this mascara is very good, but I find that it's impossible to get off. Then I took my cosmic lashes. Um, I think those were the ones in uh, Not Your Sweetheart. I do have a promo code or a discount code, however you want to say it. Now here I just took the NYX uh, total, uh, well, total Control Coverage. Um, I really do not like this foundation, but I found that it worked very well with the makeup that I was doing today, so I just kept it. Then I took in my Master Conceal by Ma uh, Ma uh, Maybelline. I think that's my Maybelline in the shade 10 Fair. I need to kick the habit that my mind is breathing in. Then here I am just kind of outlining the, um, kind of like the line on where I'm going to have the drip and the blood and all that good stuff. Then I took the Bloody Scab Spirits, uh, it's kind of like a makeup and it's, it's almost like jelly. Yeah, it's like, it's like jelly. And this just adds a lot of texture to, if you're gonna go with like, a bloody scene or anything that's on your face or whatever this just adds texture to the blood that I'm going to use later on burning the bridge that keeps us I'm here and I'm feeling Exaggerated, that's what you assume The story's over now, I must conclude I am conflicted, 
watching where I step still Hanging in the balance, not the life I want to live I want to take it all, standing tall Fear I weighed the person you are Oh part where I took that NYX total uh, I almost I always want to say coverage NYX total control drip foundation and I'm just really really putting in that drip effect that's going on and I kind of made it look like it was a melting type thing and I have I absolutely loved it I got the inspiration from James as we all know but I kind of added my little twist to it All right, you guys, and I'm so glad that you guys came to watch this with me. I really loved how this turned out. You can find all the pictures that I did on in, on my Instagram and somewhat my Facebook, not so much. But yes, if you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like down below, and I will see you guys in my next video.